Yeah, that's a, that's a great question. I think that economics, sociology, political science, these sorts of fields can tell us what is or what is likely to happen if we ease immigration restrictions, tighten immigration restrictions. They can make predictions, they can tell us what the effects will likely be, but they can't tell us what we should do, all things considered. So for example, suppose it turns out to be the case that, as some economists worry, if we increase uh, immigration to a large degree, certain American workers will be worse off. So it could be the case that certain lower skilled American workers will see their wages drop. But it could also be the case that the, the immigrants who come in um, and work in the United States will see their incomes double, triple, quadruple, and so forth. Um, economists, sociologists, political scientists can't tell us what the right way to make that trade-off is. So can we accept, morally speaking, say a 5% drop in the wages of some American workers in exchange for a 400% gain in the incomes of immigrant workers. That's a question for philosophy. That's a question for ethics.